Alright guys, so welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. I'm your host Ricardo Gardner. Alright, so guys, let's get straight into this. Now, um, in case you have the Samsung Galaxy S8 and you have updated to Android Oreo, and of course, this should also apply to the Samsung Galaxy S9 as well. I'm going to show you how to actually replace the um, bar that's down here, basically the button that allows you to pin the icons or the tab down here to the screen so for example if you look around here you'll notice that mine is gone so if I go into the web browser if I go into the web browser over here you'll notice that I cannot um, anywhere the bar comes up I cannot actually pin it so there's no option there to pin so in case you're wondering if something is wrong um, what's happening is that by default it might be turned off I'm going to show you to actually turn on this bar once again to give you the option here to actually hide or show the bar with that single button that's actually placed here in the lower um, left hand side or left hand corner so you're going to go to settings once you go into settings seeing it's a setting related to um, display we're going to go into display alright so once you're on display guys you should just scroll down and of course right down here you'll notice it says nav bar you click on nav bar right here you'll notice it gives you several options including to turn the option on and off by default after the update to android or your mind was off i was wondering if it was a feature that was removed but of course i didn't realize that it was off so if you actually come down here you can actually do that so you can go ahead and turn it on and if you look right down here you'll notice it's now there and of course all i gotta do is just stop all right that's the nav bar in place guys and in case you want to get rid of the nav bar it's simple just double tap and of course it will go away and if you swipe up it will come back and you double tap quite quickly and it will actually um, stick in place so the nav bar is actually working as it should all right all right so once setting is turned on you can actually customize the look if you want to give it um, some shades of colors you can go ahead and give it any of these shades there's a light pink and a various colors light green and so on all right of course you can um, you can set the um, hard press home button feature you can unlock with home button all right and you can actually customize the entire layout of the um, feature right there right? so that's just basically how to turn on the feature in case it goes missing and you're wondering what happened to it and so on all right so the guys this has been able to actually re-enable the nav bar on the samsung galaxy s8 and s9 in case it goes missing and i also have to customize the look and feel and so on all right guys from black tech tips and bye until next time bye